Okay, for any newbies out there that uh, haven't done uh, TRS-80 uh, stuff for a long time, um, this is what you need to know if you have a PC and you're trying to uh, get your uh, files and stuff uh, copied onto a uh, TRS-80. Can't help you when it comes to copying stuff to the uh, to the floppy drive, but um, this is what I do with my uh, Fred or Free HD uh, SD card reader for the Model Three. First, I bring stuff in on my PC. Um, I have this folder here full of uh, disk images. These are the same disk images that are used to run the uh, TRS-80 emulator. That you might, uh, or there's there's several TRS-80 emulators online, but this is these are the disk images that you would normally use with that. Um, what I have in addition to all these uh, all these files, uh, and just to show you, uh, essentially the entire library of TRS-80 model one, three, and four software easily fits into about uh, 10 megabytes of space. Um, I'm not sure if that's the entire software library, but anyway, the program I have is called TRS Tools. TRS Tools, if this comes into focus, uh, TRS Tools is the utility that you would use to extract individual files from your disk images. So I'm going to go and I'm going to open, it's already pointed to the file, but uh, let's say I wanted to copy uh, the super utilities, uh, which I actually do because I've heard a lot about them and I've, I will, I used to use it like 30 years ago and I remember it being fairly useful. So so here's the Super Utility 3, I guess, uh, SU3. So you basically, you, you highlight that file. Oh, actually, I think all it is is just a file. So I guess I'm uh, not actually uh, doing this as a, uh, it's not a, uh, not an actual disk image. So let me just, nope, it is a disk image. So I you know, open up, open up the disk image, and this is the only file on that disk image, which is the, SU3. So once you highlight that, you can then extract. That will extract SU3.CMD uh, to whatever location you select. And in this case, I'm uh, putting it into this folder up here, which is my extracted files folder. Um, that's what I just used to extract all the uh, TRS-80 games. I'm just going to use it once more for this. So I extract it to that and uh, we can see that it is right there. So there's my super utilities. So what I'm going to do now, and you'll have to, I'm going to, I'm going to pause, but I'm going to insert my uh, TRS-80 uh, my Fred SD card, so hold on for that. So here's my Fred uh, SD card. It says Model 3 on it, and it's nice and fuzzy because this is a camera phone, of course. So I'm just going to pop it into my PC, and I'm going to pause again, and you're just going to cut to the next uh, scene. So here it is. This is the... Uh, as you can see, I still have like all the games that I previously copied onto it. So I'm just going to move this over here. And I'm going to scrunch that up. So this is the Fred. This is the contents of the Fred. Uh, get rid of that. This is the contents of the, the Fred uh, SD card right here. So all I'm going to do and it's real simple. I am just going to drag this to the root of Fred. So there it is on the bottom there. So this is all set. I'm just going to uh, take this out, pop it into the TRS-80, and then we're going to do the part from there. Hold on.
All right, so I just popped the uh, fret into the uh, reader. And now we're just gonna do a uh, directory of zero. I'm gonna get rid of this light, it's kinda harsh. So, Notice you do not see a uh, Fred, or you, you don't see the uh, super utility on there. Uh, that's because it hasn't been imported yet, and that's where I'm going to use this awesome utility called uh, Import2. So I'm just going to type in Import2 SU3 dot CM, whoops, D. To S. Actually, I'm going to rename it to to Super Util slash C M P, and I'm going to um, I'm going to leave it on the uh, going to leave it on drive zero. Um, but uh, I'm renaming it Super Utility. But basically, the uh, the import to command is you know import to the file name dot cmd a lot of people don't realize that you need to use the uh, the dos name here or you know dos slash windows name here so it would be file name dot extension and then you save it as the file name slash extension which is for you know ldos so we're just going to do that and you can see things are happening up there and and then we're ready and then I can just type super and there we go zap purge format backup repair yeah this this brings back memories it's been so long since I've seen super utility working but now I gotta relearn everything about how to how to use it. And let's see, file utilities. I can do. Hmm. Yeah. So there it is. That is how to convert one file from uh, your PC that you've downloaded from whatever TRS-80 archive to get it onto your Fred uh, SD card reader, so that you can uh, use it on a uh, TRS-80 equipped with that. Um, if you needed to go one step further, you could put it on the floppy drives and that would be just the way you normally would do it, uh, without Fred. You would just address, you know, you would get the, uh, you would take the, the program from, you would copy the program from your PC to the Fred drive and then from Fred you would copy it to the floppy drive, uh, you know, zero, or six, or seven, uh, if you get the standard uh, Fred setup. Um, then other people can use your stuff who don't have a Fred. But uh, you know, we uh, we have one, and we're we're happy with it, and we're using it. But this is how to do it, and hopefully this video helps other people. Uh, thanks a lot.